So Gaffer, what's your uh, take on today? Sir so Gaffer again, I love it when you say that. Did you like that? Well, I think you deserve <laughs> it after that. You masterminded a really you know hard performance. The, the lads did it, that's for sure. And uh, it was a fantastic performance by them. Absolutely fantastic. They were very proud of our club on and off the field because those supporters over there kept us going. It was at the far end, you know, we were trying to defend that and it'd been great if they'd have been behind us, but they, but they still made, made themselves out. Uh, and the lads have said, you know, how, how that kept them going, us screaming from this side and our fans screaming from that side. So on and off the pitch, we can only be proud of, proud of our football club. What did you make of the Vegas? Well, it definitely was, absolutely. Um, 100% in my life, because somebody goes back. Um, yes, if the lad knocks the ball and it goes in the same direction, and then it goes down through the trees, and that's obviously all three things been made Red card because he's through on guard. Great time. So I'll see it again, but I've seen it a couple of times. I thought at the time it was a uh, good tackle. He did definitely touch the ball. So of course, you're rear, so you're down the ten men, crowd it up. Um, but yeah, it's disappointing for that. And I was disappointed right through the game, but I was a bit misleading, but I was also trying to keep up with it. Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 The game now very well. Because we actually started really well, so that would have been, you know, the, 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 the first half hour, man. Sorry, uh, but the first half hour, I thought it was fantastic. You know, we had a game plan that we had to work on. Um, not many teams come here and take the game to Notch County. There won't be many teams like that to do that. Um, and we did, and we kept nicking it off them, which broke this pattern a little bit. Um, they still had a couple of chances because that's what happens. But uh, we also had some very, very good chances. So that first, like, that's why it was so disappointing because we've done so well with 11 men in their half. Despite having 10 men, went on and took the lead and actually defended that lead manfully. Wrong to single out anybody, but Dan Martin making his debut was superb for us. Well, every, he did, and we were very pleased with him, really. Um, and we had others that give, them, give everything. You could tell that by, you know, they were going down. We crammed, we had to take two off that had gone down, so that wasn't time wasting. That was literally because they, they'd give their all. Um, and so I was pleased with that. Um, what was your first question? Just saying how well Dan Martin played, it's wrong to see Yeah, that's right. I, exactly. You can't single out. You can, and I appreciate that, and that he did do well. But uh, everybody's had to put in a shift. Like everybody and uh, people, like players that like to play sometimes can't. They have to do a job when it's that you know, you're one nil up. Great goal by Dan because he was brave. Goalkeepers know that he don't mind a punch in the ear, he's going to go for those to get his uh, goal on his name on the score sheet. So that was great, and we had something to fight for, and that's always a, a good thing. Unfortunately, they scored a good goal. Minutes to go or so, and you thought, oh no, it's going to be a bit the Alamo. But we had a couple of chances at the other end. You've got to still give yourself a chance. You're not going to be up that end regular, but when you do, and you had a free kick on the edge of the box, you had another one where Dan Lee got in, Connor had a shot, it could have been better. So we still was a threat, uh, not often, but enough to make them think. Um, the game was in and around our penalty area for some time, but we defended like a trophy. And, and they did, didn't they? Because Mark Holster didn't have to make a huge amount of saves. No, the saves he did and the couple of catches he made were vital. You know, A, because it calms everything down, B, because we can get up the pitch. Um, but remember the one down low in the first half there was a good save, because that was quite early on. No, he was a big part, he was a big part uh, like everybody was in there. I feel like it's a win, we do. I know we won it up and we went one on, but um, I feel that uh, in the circumstances, it was a massive point. You mentioned the Yellow Army, of course, though, Sun the Hearts take great reward for them as well, bringing the first away game they've been to for yeah. so many, such a long time. But now, um, also, we can all look forward to the game in just 48 hours' time against our old friends from Wolves. Yeah, well, we've got some young lads and they're, they're fit and healthy and uh, you know, we'll have to put them in cold baths for the next couple of days and hope that they, you know, they recover sufficiently. I mean, 
although Woking didn't go down to 10 men, um, you know, they lost their game um, and they played. So you know, it's no, no different really. So we just got to uh, make sure that which ones are, are fine. We've got Connor and Acer now, they've had a few more minutes. Um, so that's good. Um, yeah, and you know, we, we've got to find a centre half. You know, at least you know, whether we appeal or not, it might be an idea to, to appeal. I'll have a look at that. I think one of the things for me was as well, I was just saying, saying over there, that it's, I get so disappointed um, when I see two lads that we've worked really hard with, I've got them to where they helped them get to where they've got, and then they're playing against us at the same level. And really, like Sam Sherry, they should have gone off somewhere else. So that's always this players that you worked hard with um, and were part of what you do then going to the same level, you know what I mean? Um, I, mean I wouldn't get that out of my system. All three of them that's even came through friends because I talk to him as well. But uh, anyway, that's life and uh, always help me go home and smile on the front. I know that Yellow Army books so yeah. New United Heroes to cheer on tonight and uh, thank you for joining us back folks and congratulations on the front of the show. I appreciate it. Thank you.